Tell me something about yourself, which course you have done, your institute name and the year of your passing. So I am Shanta Kumar. I am uh, doing uh, B.Tech Mechanical and uh, I am going to be 2017 passed out batch, like this year I will be finishing. Okay. Univ your college, your university name? Shastra University. Okay. In Tanjore, main campus. Okay. Tell me about the faculty of Shastra University. Uh, Rebel, ma'am? Yeah, yeah, you are. I'm saying that, okay. tell me about the faculty of Sasa University. How is it? Like, faculty, uh, all of them are very good. They are very friendly. Especially okay. if you take up, I don't know about other departments. In my, in my department, mechanical engineering, the staff are very good and they are having a lot of knowledge. And uh, they are having a lot of experience also. They're like, uh, we, you can't find anyone so like uh, new. Uh, they are coming out there and uh, quickly coming up to the, and teaching there without uh, pursuing their PhD. So most of them, uh, like all of them will become uh, like uh, at least pursuing their PhD. And most of them would have completed their PhD. So all of them will be having a very good knowledge. Okay. So what rating you will give out of 10? Like 8. 8 you will give out of yeah. 10. Okay. Next comes for the infrastructure. So, will you tell review under dot com about the infrastructure of Sastra University? Yeah, it's a great infrastructure, like not modified anything. Uh, as of right now, uh, uh, to take up for, for this past four years, and they are not modified anything of uh, this past four years. They are constructed two new buildings uh, for the biotechnology department, the research and development. Uh, that was very good, but other than that, other than that, uh, they are not developed a very uh, good thing. But mm -hmm. actually, it is a very good environment if you uh, look for that. So I will give uh, out of ten, I'll give uh, seven. Seven for the infrastructure, okay. Yeah. How is the quality of food, or how healthy is your canteen food or your mess food? I'm not in hospital, so uh, I can't review both the hospital food. So as of my friend said. Like it is not uh, that much food, but it is still hygienic food. So okay. for food, I will give uh, five. Five. Okay. And have you have tasted the canteen food or that also you have not tasted? Yeah, I have taken canteen food. Like canteen food it will be very nice. Uh, okay. like, you will be having uh, three, two canteens and uh, it can, uh, it will be uh, a nice over there. Okay. And uh, various so options are there uh, or very limited options in the canteen? Like, uh, they have a wide range of uh, varieties over there. Like uh, within that uh, main uh, one, within that one canteen itself, we will be having two separate uh, uh, the horror will be there. One will be canister and another will be mango juice will be there. Okay. So that uh, a lot of options will be available there in the canteen also. Okay. That's but if good. you need to give the rating for the overall food, which includes the canteen as well as mess, how much you will give out of ten? So. Out of 10, I will give uh, 6. 6 out of 10. Like okay. Since it's a vegetarian, uh, uh, since it's a vegetarian, I mean, uh, mm -hmm. we go to canteen, so we will be having only a limited number of foods over there. So okay. I will give uh, 6 out of 10. Okay. Next comes for the placement. So will you tell reviewatna.com about the placement of Sastra University? Yeah, placements. Like regarding the placements, the Sastra is seriously very good. For like they will give you assurance for about 100% each. And uh, literally, they do so. I got uh, also placed in Renault Maison. So, uh, for uh, placements, I'll give, but definitely give 8 out of 10. 8 out of that's, 10. Okay. Yeah, because that's uh, uh, one uh, bad thing is like you can't get uh, too much amount of course placements as you compare to NIT, mm -hmm. but it is equally good uh, to NIT precinct. Okay, all right. Uh, is there any kind of challenge you have personally faced due to management or any rules or regulations? Have you personally experienced any difficulty, any challenge? Yeah, yeah I think uh, like I have uh, faced uh, quite a lot of difficulties out there. Like uh, not me exactly. Like my friend will be taking a lot of difficulties. Uh, like regulations are very uh, strict. You can't go out there uh, after 8.30 30 p.m. with uh, Adam's uh, car. The so call will be there for boys at 8 30, and for girls, they will not allow uh, outside uh, the college on weekdays. And uh, they can go on week weekends only that too. Uh, those uh, bodyguards will be escorting them in the bus. 
they can go in the college bus only in morning and uh, again they will they take back the girls in the uh, college bus itself in the evening and that too on the weekend that too on sunday only other than that they can't go in uh, uh, on weekdays and all and uh, girls for the girls they're like they're like 30 or so now i think it has been since the 6 o'clock they will they should get a roll call um, a uh, roll call at their hostels okay so that is yeah. one of the main problems and the management problems like in the office uh, when you go to office for any sort of uh, uh, personal issues like if for collecting your income tax certificate or uh, any other office related issues uh, like mm-hmm. they will not be uh, that much friendly over there they will be very much harsh on us students okay so, all right office is very strict so if, if you see only one variety out of 10 i'll mm-hmm. give uh, like five out of 10 or four out of 10 okay. four out of 10 exactly okay last comes for the environment so will you tell reviewwater.com about the overall environment of sastra university how is it uh, so think about the environment it is not situated in uh, like main and in the city in the city it is situated out of the city right? but you can if you see uh, there are a lot of trees would be there uh, so it's a friendly environment only uh, so i'll give Seven out of ten. You will give seven out of ten for it. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So thank.